In June of 1944, the Montgomery family in Ford City got the worst news they could get. One of their sons was killed and missing in action. But thanks to the U.S. Army, Lieutenant William Montgomery's remains have been recovered. And Ross Gadotti talked to two of the fallen flyers' nephews and has more on this homecoming for a hero. High above the European battlefield in World War II, young William Montgomery from Ford City was piloting command of a massive B-24 Liberator bomber named Wolfpack. He was a leader. He was charismatic um, and a very unselfish man. No greater example than what happened when Montgomery's heavy bomber was hit in a raid over France and in big trouble. It was a brutal um, return flight. Trying to keep the plane in the air, he ordered his crew to the back of the aircraft to keep its nose up. But not long after that, Montgomery gave another order. He told them to bail out. Moments later, Montgomery, his co-pilot and navigator were lost as the plane hit the ground, making a 20-foot hole in a British farm field. A few years later, after the war, the Montgomery family was told their son was never coming home. The amazing thing is 79 years later, they found him after declaring him unrecoverable. Thanks to aircraft archaeologists and an Army forensic team, Montgomery's remains were found along with his W&J college ring. It's a testament to the U.S. Army. God bless them that they did that and stuck with it. Today, nephews Bill Montgomery, named after his fallen uncle, and Braden Montgomery are relieved that Uncle Bill, who was lost in the war, will finally rest in peace. He's home and he will be, he will be given a hero's funeral at Arlington. No date for the funeral is set. We'll leave you with this. There are still 81,000 Americans listed as missing in action from all of the nation's wars. In the newsroom, Ross Gadotti, KDKA News.